we're losing the spirit of Ramadan. And in terms of spirituality, we cannot pray at night because the curfew starts at 8 p.m. and the prayer starts at 8 p.m. Traditionally, people celebrate Ramadan with meals, gatherings, and discussions with family and friends. But this year, worshippers have had to reinvent the way they observe the Islamic holy month of Ramadan. On Zoom, at home, or in a mosque where only 25 people are allowed to gather to pray in Quebec's red zones. For us before, like, everybody's waiting for sunset to gather around the table, to eat together. And now we're losing that sense because the kids are tired already. They go to school and they're always afraid. They have the mask all over the time. The parents are tired. So it's a lot of struggling. Uh, Ramadan in general is uh, uh, an uplifting uh, and joyous occasion for all Muslims. And when you, when you, when you get in, to a situation like this, this would be quite difficult for us to, most importantly, uh, charge our spirituality. The month of Ramadan, largely community-led with late-night prayers and iftar get-togethers to break the fast. But with the ongoing health measures due to COVID-19, Muslims are turning to digital spaces to celebrate Ramadan, although some say Zoom meetings aren't quite the same. For the dinner, frankly, it doesn't work much. Like, because uh, uh, for us, this meal should be in family with like big crowd. Yeah, individuals, singles are using uh, a lot of technology to chat at least over uh, over a plate to break the bread together virtually. You can never replace that. That prayer, we 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 the video issues. It is not to, maybe to pass information, maybe to give. Uh, uh, listens, uh, maybe to answer questions, yes, we do that. But uh, not everyone uh, has a, a tablet and uh, has the skills to connect. Uh. For the second year in a row, the month of fasting, prayer, charity and reflection for the Muslim community in Canada is taking place during the COVID-19 pandemic. The al Medina Centre, usually hosting over 250 people in their religious building, are now serving food at the door and hosting prayers during the day with a maximum of 25 worshippers at a time, wearing masks and social distancing. People are suffering. They still come, but they're always afraid. And for the prayers, they need really peace of mind. They need tranquility. They want to meditate, basically. They want to think. So they're coming and they feel deep inside everybody's afraid. Ramadan lasts 29 or 30 days, depending on the length of the lunar cycle. And most are hopeful that the ongoing vaccination campaign will allow them to celebrate Ramadan as they know it next year. For us as Muslims, we hope that we're going to be able to go back to celebrate, to pray, to worship, to visit each other, to invite each other and to share. In Montreal, Samsara Rainville, City News.